it'd be a 2 1 defeat today. How's your reflection on performance? Um, it's bittersweet. I think today was probably the most attacking we've been. Um, but again, um, individual errors has kind of cost us again. Um, it's a hard one to take because we just got back into the game, getting in 1 1. and It's not a foul, but at the end of the day, he's, he's giving it, and then we've got to regroup and get back into shape and try to stop, stop them getting another chance into the box. But um, I think it's a poor decision from the ref. And, but it is what it is. Um, but it's a hard one to take, to be honest with you, because I think we, we played well, we grew, in, we grew into the game, and um, yeah, we should have just been able to see it out. But, it was a hard one, yeah. I think, yeah, you know, looking around, especially the old shot players, everyone just seems a little bit deflated and everything. It just feels like, you know, we've done so well to get back into the game with yeah. Corey's goal and, yeah. you know, to lose the game the way we had, it's a little bit frustrating, yeah. as you say. Yeah, definitely. And I think it's because of how well we was doing until they scored again. I think because um, the momentum was on our side as we scored in, I think it was like 60, uh, 75th minute or so. And then um, I really think we would have got the second goal. I think um, we had a bit between our, our teeth now and then. We could have got a, scored another goal, but uh, yeah, the goal is going to come at a worse time to be honest with you. So, um, but yeah, hard one to take. But we have to, we just have to dust ourselves off and go again on on Saturday next week against Notts County. Like we can't feel sorry for ourselves at the end of the day. Um, taking the weight of not scoring now off our shoulders now, and um, that's going to be another. That's a bit of a plus. You know, I mean, that's one thing to take away from today. But um, yeah, we need to get some points on the board. It's a results business at the end of the day. Because for you, it's your first start for the club. Yeah. How are you feeling afterwards? Uh, knackered. But, um, no, no, no. I'm joking. No, um, I feel good. I feel good. I feel fit, ready. I've played with Jacob and Corbin before at academy level. We all played um, together. Um, so I feel like today we've got glimpses of seeing how me and him can play well together. Um, and yeah, really, I think we're just ready to go and help the team get some points on the board. Because I think that was a thing, especially in the second half, you know, there was definitely moments between you and Corey, certainly uh, yeah. on the right, but it was causing problems for you over when yeah. ultimately it would give you time to bond and gel and work together as a partnership. And yeah. there is something to work on there moving forwards. Yeah, definitely. I think it just comes with game time as well, like just playing together consistently, just then getting that wave and how we normally play anyway. Um, and I think it will come. I think once, I think it's once we once we get that first win, it's going to be easy. I think it, I think it's just a momentum thing as well because it's the beginning of the season, so it's just that um, getting it going. The one plus I would definitely say is that we're not playing bad football. I think now is just now getting the results and up our performance, um, mirroring the results as well. So. That's what we want to do at the moment, yeah. Yeah, because I think that's the thing that's ultimately disappointing is, you know, we've come away from these three games and, you know, I would argue we haven't, we haven't played really poorly, played you know, so mm. to, that's the most disappointing thing is come away from these games with a good showing and yeah. to lose the three games, it's something that, you know, we're sort of scratching our heads a little bit thinking how we come away with nothing from those yeah. games. I think that's that's the that's the big thing that we're, we've we been told by the gaffer as well. At the end of the day, it's all nice playing good and that, but at the end of the day, we need three points or a point. Um, and it doesn't really matter what you do during the game, at the end of the day, after 90 minutes, you either got a point, three points or no points. And the harsh truth is we've got none at the last three games. So we need to focus on just trying to get a point, try to get a win in our next coming games, and then build from that. I think once we do that, we will have a real strong good season. And that starts with a tough test away at Notts County on Saturday. Yeah, yeah definitely. Um, we know what they're about, we know they're a decent team. Um, but at the end of the day, it's still going to be 11 on the pitch. And um, so there will be 11 on the pitch and to be honest with you, anything can happen at the end of the day. Are you in the shop? Sign up below. Click here for the next video and click here to subscribe. Stop.